Hello guys! My name is Lauren and welcome sa aking channel. Today, pag-uusapan natin ang aking skincare routine. I'm not a skin expert or a dermatologist. I just happen to like taking care of my skin and I have tried so many products throughout the years and I think I have something that I could recommend to you guys. Just a little background about my skin type. I have combination and sensitive skin. So what does that mean? That means I get oily on some areas but some areas, they're dry. So that's combination skin and sensitive because after trying a new product, I'm going react to it kapag may ginamit ako na hindi niya gusto. So, that's it. Combination and sensitive skin. Okay, let's get this thing started for for real. <laughs> so, let's first start with the makeup remover. So, at the end of the day, it's important that you remove your makeup for so many reasons. Your makeup, it gets sticky and yung dumi, kakatid lang siya sa makeup mo and magpo-produce yan ng mas marami pang dumi while it's still on your face. So, just remove it. For the makeup remover, I used to use this one, the Garnier Micellar Oil Infused Cleansing Water and it's very gentle. You just have to put this on like a cotton round and then uh, wipe your makeup off. But recently, I discovered a very, very cheap alternative to makeup removers and they're also very effective. And that is this one, microfiber. So anything microfiber, like microfiber towel or microfiber rounds like this ones. Babasain mo lang siya ng water and then you just wipe off your makeup and you're done. As in, kahit anong waterproof makeup pa yung nilagay mo sa mata mo or kahit face paint pa yung nilagay ko sa mukha ko, natatanggal talaga niya. Super effective. I have a very simple and very basic na rules when it comes to my skincare routine. And that is um, exfoliate mildly every day and moisturize every day. That's it. That's it. It's gonna give you very smooth skin. I have baby smooth skin. Whether you believe it or not, it's not my problem. Anyway, so for the shower part. So this um, first process is, is optional. You can just skip this one. But... It's something that I like to do when I have the time and I have the energy to do it. I use the virgin coconut oil to put it on the areas that I want to um, scrub more just so that I can um, prepare it for the exfoliation that I'm gonna do later on. After that, I prepare my skin for the next process by rinsing it off with water. So the next process is very crucial to my skincare routine because I've been doing this ever since I was 17 and I think this is really the key to achieving baby smooth skin. And this is using the bath salt. And I usually buy this one just so I can have something to refill the actual bath salt I use. And the actual salt I use is this one, this brand. I sometimes use the lavender version of this and this is all this also smells really good but I don't like the container of this that's why I buy this kasi ito pag ni-refill mo siya dito sakto lang siya so may lagayan ka for this one so after mo maubos to this is also a pretty good bath salt it's just more expensive than this one and I really love the smell for this one so that's just the reason why I bought this too. so I can refill this one to this one but you can just buy a container if you want. Nagkataon lang sakto yung container na to para sa buong bath salt na ito. So I just scrub the bath salt on the areas where I wanna avoid getting dark like my elbows. Oh, the lighting is so intense today. Anyway, so I let that sit on my skin for 3 minutes and then after that I will rinse it off with water. And then I will proceed to the next step which is using my first soap. <laughs> So the first soap I use is for cleaning my skin or doing the micro exfoliation for the whole body. So what I use for the gentle exfoliation is this, Kojic Acid. So I've been using this soap for ever since I was 17, I think. I switched to the ano, Glutacy with Kojic Plus. I don't have the box of it, but I can just show it on the other side of the screen. So, 
nag-work naman siya sa akin. I think the key ingredient talaga is the kojic acid. And if other products work for you, then that's your cleaning soap. Basta, I use the cleaning soap first. And can I just use a loofah to scrub it on my skin. Very gentle lang. And then after that, I rinse off with water. And then I'm gonna proceed with my moisturizing soap. Now we have to be really, really nice to our skin by moisturizing it. And for that, I use this one, the Dove, yeah, Dove White Beauty Bar. Pabubulain ko lang siya with my hands, and then I just put that directly on my skin, and then I rinse like with water. And that's it for the shower skincare procedure. After that, I just put lotion on my skin. So I use this brand for my lotion. I like it because it's not sticky and it has natural ingredients for the moisturizing part. And also it's cheaper than like Palmer's. <laughs> Gusto ko talaga yung Palmer's kasi mabango siya but hindi ko siya afford. So it's cheaper than the other lotion so I highly recommend this one. And then for the deodorant, I just use this one. I think it's also essential that I recommend to you guys the deodorant I use kasi it also the, it doesn't leave any residue behind. Para lang siyang tubig and it does a good job like keeping you off from body odor. So yeah, this is the deodorant I use. So next is the facial cleanser. So I said I don't have any facial cleanser, but I meant was like I don't have facial soap or like a do you know those like foaming cleansers? So wala ako nun. But what I do have is this one, the Eskinol Pimple Fighting Facial Cleanser. Pero this one, I don't use this every day. I only use this when I have acne. Na gusto kong mag-dry. Yun. And there's a time of the month na nagkakaroon talaga ako ng acne because of my period. And this is what I use to get rid of the acne and the acne mark. So, I don't use this all the time, but when I use this, I use this with my reusable cotton rounds, which I highly recommend for everyone. Dahil, it's good for the environment. And at the same time, imagine mo nagtatapon ka lang palagi ng cotton balls or cotton pads. But this one, you, ha you just have to put it in this container that comes with it. Um, and then this one, isasama mo lang siya sa laundry mo and then magagamit mo na siya ulit after niya matuyo. After nun, I use uh, facial toner. And for my facial toner, I use this glue to see. This is alcohol-free and also it has this anti-aging thing, glutathione and vitamin C. So, what I like about this is that ang dami ko na kasing natry na product for toner. Kasi dati, walang toner na nag-work sa skin ko. I think the active ingredient for this is the um, salicylic acid. I think my skin has improved a lot because I started using this. I think Lutasi should actually sponsor me. This is not sponsored but yeah, I've been using a lot of their products. Okay, so after my facial toner, I use a uh, night serum, but this one is optional. You don't have to actually use this. For the serum, this is what I use. Surprise, surprise! I'm using the Glutac Facial Night Repair Serum. I, I just love using it because it makes my skin very, very soft. And it is also anti-aging, so I feel like um, 40 years from now, we'll see about that. After that, this one is not optional. I've been putting this product on my videos as my moisturizer. This is the cream that I use every day ever since I was again 17. Anyway, the facial cream that I use is this one. The Olay, come on, the Olay Natural White with UV protection. And not gonna lie, I used to buy the one on the sachet, but my sister actually judged me. <laughs> Naturally, if you have to go out, you should put, um, you should put on sunscreen, but I don't put on sunscreen anymore on my face because of this one. Kasi meron daw tong UV protection. I think we're done with my regular skincare routine. Yeah, it's pretty basic, di ba? Don't get me wrong, there are some random stuff that I do when I feel like my skin needs them. So, for example, the coconut oil, I use that on my skin whenever I feel like that my skin is extra dry. Um, and also this um, night repair serum i don't feel like i need it that much but i started using it recently because 
um, you know, I'm getting old and I feel like I need to start using anti-aging products. Sometimes when it's too hot, like right now, it's been really, really hot. I use this one. This is an ice roller that I just got from Shopee. Kapag sobrang init, pakiramdam ko, nagre-react yung balat ko to that. So, I use the ice roller when that happens. But I don't use this all the time. And also, you have to be careful about using ice rollers. Kasi, um, when it's too cold, tapos bigla mo siyang nalapat, baka masira yung mga um, nerves nyo dyan sa face nyo. Just so you know, there are so many factors that could affect um, your skin condition. Hindi lang yung skincare products nyo yung nakaka-apekto. Nakaka-apekto din kung ano yung pinakain nyo, kung ano yung lifestyle nyo, kung lagi ba kayo nasa labas, bumabiyahe ba kayo, lagi kayo nagdudumihan. So, yung mga ganun bagay nakaka-apekto siya. Sometimes, it's just hormones or yung mga food na kinakain nyo din, nakaka-apekto siya sa balad nyo. So, maraming bagay na nakaka-apekto sa skin condition nyo. So, how do I avoid these things? I... I sometimes do exercise, <laughs> but recently I've been very, very lazy. Um, I also try to drink a lot of water. I'm not sure if that helps, but I still do it. I feel like it helps. Kano na feel ko na that's right for my skin. Eh, yun naman yung katawan yung mas alam nyo yung tama. So yun yung ituloy nyo. Yung mga hindi tama kahit ganon ka mahal pa yung ginamit nyo. Itigil nyo yun kung hindi na work sa balat nyo. Also, um. I think I need to disclose that um, on top of the skin care products, I also drink um, vitamin to help my skin. So I drink, um, I started drinking collagen and biotin. So I have this collagen thing and also this biotin and also vitamin C. So this is from my friend. Thank you so much for sending me this. So. Yun. So, itong mga to, iniinom ko din siya. And I think they are very crucial to helping my skin look um, healthy. And, yun lang naman. So, that's it. I think I have shared everything. So, I hope I was able to help you guys with your skincare routines too. So, if may mga existing product na nag work sa skin nyo, just don't let go of those products. Yeah, so I think this is a pretty good year to actually work on ourselves, um, not only with our physical health, but our emotional health and our financial health, mental health, emotional health, whatever health. Yeah, I think it's a pretty good year to actually work on ourselves. And I am telling you guys, when you start actually taking care of your skin, it would um, make you feel better. It has made me feel better throughout the years that when I take care of my skin, I feel like I've been taking care of myself and that's just gonna um, put everything into place. So again, this is Lauren and thank you for watching and see you on my next video. Bye! So what happened when I was 17 that has pushed me to actually care more about my skin? Who knows? I'm kidding. It was a, it was an ex-boyfriend he cheated. <laughs> oh, that's a joke. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye-bye. Forget to invest in watching this. Bye!